So, uh, sorry about that. I'm like, saying, it just annoys me so much. It's like, the kids aren't good. I'm not going to want it, I want it, I want it, I want it. And she, uh, it just annoys me so much. And the kid, mum buys it, the, the, the game for the kid. And then she, she finds out what Gears of War is, what it's basically. As most game fans already know what I mean by Gears of War, it's, more, it's a bloody game. It says bird gore. It has chainsaws on the fucking pictures. What did she do? That, and I'm going to go. She sees the game to go. She, the game, so you're not playing this game. I'm going like, oh, that one you're playing, but she then goes up to where she bought the game saying, I want to. You saw me this game. And I bought this game for my kid and basically over Christmas. Well, how old is your kid? Five years old. Well, it's for 18 year old kid. Well, it doesn't matter, it's a computer game, it should be for everyone. Like, uh, and then this is just, it hasn't, it's not like one thing. I've heard more it's always that like, parents like buy games for the young kids, like hardcore games, like Gears of War, like Fate, uh, Fallout, like uh, Halo, even Halo. <laughs> uh, like, Gears Mad World on the Wii, I've heard stories about parents being disgusted what happens on Mad World. Even like somehow they think Sonic or Mario is aggressive, like they, how the hell is they aggressive? It doesn't make sense. And then they try to put the blame, and then you hear stories that people go and killing people, and you hear back stories about they used to play aggressive shooting games like Gears of War, like Halo, like Manhunt, and, they, and, and the newspaper bring out articles saying, kid plays. Go playing Gears of War kills 20 people. I'm going, oh, it's games. It's because games are brainwashing our kids. It's I'm going, no, it isn't brainwashing. It ain't brainwashing. It's not like it's not like the gaming companies brainwashing all the kids in the world to go crash, to do mass murder. It's just stupid. But like, I play Gears of War. I play Halo. I played multi bloody games. I've played Mad World before, but I've never killed anyone. I've got many friends who who have guns and they they I got friends in Texas who's, who's mad about guns but he hasn't shot anyone and he the big fan of Gears of War. And it just pisses me off. I've got friends who play Mortal Kombat and that's another crazy game. Crazy but they are not gonna they're not gonna rip someone's fucking head off with their fist. And half the games, half the shooting games are on what bloody are are making not realistic. When you go to saw, when you go into movies, are more realistic, more graphic, more aggressive, more plotting, and much more real. I can name a few. Saw. You got Saw. You got Te Texas, <laughs> Texas Chainsaw Massacre. You got Hannibal. You got uh, what else? You got. You got the Red Dragon. You got uh, Bone Collector, Bone Daddy. You've got. Uh, I know it done last summer. You got Thor, not Thor. I was Thor. Scott, Scream, Final Destination. All those movies. I'm in the final. <laughs> I'm so, but more people can pick on ideas on that and go kill people. But if they do, the movie is not going to get the blame. It's just going to be the person not going. If the movies get, get allowed to do all those kind of stuff, and I've never seen a movie being something being milk has been too over aggressive. I can't think of any movie what I've heard what's been blocked. I know there's a few of them, like Exorcist, because people have died from heart attacks at the, it, when they get stopped because then they get released. I'm pretty sure Exorcist. You know what I mean? Because a lot of people, like old people, die from heart attacks watching the movie. You know, the one with the spinning girl's head. It just. And then you've got Jack the Whipper movies or being banned before. Yeah, but there's not like, computer games. Some computer games are banned, like Manhunt 2 being banned in Europe. I'm not going. Yeah, but they don't, they don't get as bad react. Movies don't get bad rep as computer game companies do. It just pisses me off, and the parents sort of blame. What annoys me the most, the parents 
when they buy the game for like a five or seven year old kid, they don't take responsibility to buy it. Well, do you actually, it's just bad parents, it ain't the gamer's fault, the game company put all the warnings on there for a reason why it's for